Hi folks, it's Guitars Forever here with yet another guitar. This is an absolute beauty. Look at that. Oh my god. It is a 1974 Gibson Les Paul Deluxe. You can see it. Um, it's got a little bit of checking on the headstock. I don't know, like I say, I'm being pretty finicky, but I don't really care what you think or what anyone thinks. Just want to show some beautiful guitars. 1974. All original. Near mint condition. I don't know. I just. When I saw this bad boy, I had to have it. Um, I've only had it a couple years, haven't played it a lot. Um, deluxes are just beautiful. They. They, they they sound heavy, but they've just got a little... They obviously sound brighter, but... Um, it's, it's making a noise on the chair. It's just... I mean, look at this thing. It's just amazing. How about... It's incredible. I love using that word. And the finish on this thing. Cherry Sunburst. Um, the story about... Cherry Sunbursts... Randall's in there, sorry about that. It was my friend, Steve Jensen. I'll tell you that story when I sit down, because that's a good story. <laughs> but yeah, rosewood fretboard, trapezoid, or whatever you call them, inlays, original humbuckers. I mean, this thing is meant. I mean, I don't care, I love the, the Gibson from the 70s. So it has got a little bit of checking on it, but that's um, that's okay. That happens with guitars. It's got some on the back. Um, back's got a little few little things, but who gives a crap? Sorry about the light reflection. It's kind of cool to have um, checking on a guitar. But this thing is just unbelievable. Unbelievable. Look at that neck. Um, neck profile is, um, I don't know, it's f not too thick, not too thin. Um, it's kind of one of those, I don't know. I mean, I had a... Um, I'm going to put this down. I had an 80 and an 81 Deluxe uh, Tobacco Burst. And a... Um, where's that going to film? Oh, Firebird. Get that Firebird out of there. <laughs> there was another guitar in there too. Oh, well. um, I had an 80 and an 81, I think it was, Tobacco Burst. And, um, Rush fans. G string. Um, like I say, I had an eighty and eighty one, an eighty and an eighty one deluxe. Um, the necks on those, I think I had a gold top. The gold top had a, one of those really flat necks. And uh, I didn't, it was a cool guitar, but it was one of those really flat Gibson necks. Oh, it's just, I didn't hate it, but I prefer this neck. And then I had, I think, an 81 Tobacco Burst, which was really nice. It was a little bit, you know, a little bit of wear on it, a few chunks, and a ding down by the bottom here that somebody dropped it on the ground. Oh, yeah, what an idiot, but hey, shit happens. Um, that had kind of a chunky neck, 
should never gotten rid of that one. Had a bit of a bird's eye top on it, and um, I love that guitar. But I made some good money on it. I got that and a Randall Cabin Hiwa for next to nothing, like 750 bucks for a deluxe 